so the question is where do you make those changes um, the ch uh, what I changed was the behavior the default behavior of the uh, view history and it um, in its um, in its properties view for the for the frame itself make sure that you do select uh, the entire frame uh, that the frame is the one that you're looking at and when you look at its properties in the properties uh, tab uh, there's default close operation and uh, uh, there is a drop down box and it tells you that you can hide exit on close which was the original and default setting uh, do nothing or dispose um, and uh, we're just going to hide it Yes, you're welcome. Okay, so this is fine. Um, so we have this basic setup. Uh, let's see. So um, basically, we do have all of our classes. I'm just switching back to the controller right now. As you can see, it's it's. Uh, I think you know. Arguably, it's very easy to follow. We have this. Um, uh, uh, we have this um, a main app right here all it does is is just says uh, uh, let's uh, let's do controller nyr and create that um, with one little um, uh, one little uh, uh, um, uh, concern here I'd like to show you that we actually promised we actually ma made a promise to um, never um, talk to our window classes uh, directly from uh, say main thread and that's exactly what we did so we need to uh, carefully change this and uh, to change this uh, here's something that we can do um, if you look at let's start with view main right here view main when we create it uh, view main if you scroll down this is the code generated for us uh, just take a look. Uh, there is a main. Um, uh, there is a main um, uh, main method added to the class by NetBeans uh, Designer, and look what it does. It, it it does in a much better approach. It says um, event queue invoke later, and this is a request to the event dispatch thread to at some point make our window visible so just 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 to know that it's easy to make this mistake especially when we're just about to get started so instead of doing what we did here right instead of this a uh, quick correction uh, we should we should uh, um, um, uh, generally speaking we should probably do this this is fine create uh, actually no I'm, I'm sorry uh, it's it's a static method so we don't have to create this object um, actually uh, let me just verify that once again um, in view main um, yes the new view main is constructed and instantly it is made visible so let's make this change so uh, um, instead of uh, these lines of code that I just implemented um, instead I should probably use that uh, main method which was already added to me by simply saying view main and I'll use the class name uh, and call main right uh, call main uh, and that main call expects uh, a uh, uh, a set of uh, arguments but this is of course an array so it, since I'm not using uh, any input parameters to main um, inside my windows I can just simply uh, pass a null uh, reference to that main right so uh, it essentially saying don't expect uh, much of the input there so uh, view main call main and then view history right view history uh, do the same thing so perhaps this is a much better choice because uh, we need to uh, because what happens here is that what we do on our main thread which enters our application directly in this method we execute the constructor we create our controller object what the controller object wants to do is to construct the two windows and make them both visible 
asked, right? And uh, we just realized that, uh, you know, this would be a bit of a naive way of doing things, whereas uh, there is a better way of doing things and uh, uh, essentially using this uh, main method which conveniently has been generated for us. By default, what main method does in both windows implemented by uh, NetBeans Designer, that uh, what it does is that it, first of all, it calls um, the run method here, and uh, what it does, uh, it implements the it implements that run method and says that uh, create new main and then set it visible right away. And it does this for both of our windows. So anyway, with this change, very small change, if we run this again, uh, the behavior should be exactly the same. The history window should not exit, right? And it doesn't. And when you press, when you close the New Year's resolution window, the application exits. So um, I'd like to essentially get get rid of these uh, old uh, and naive versions of creation of a window right away. And uh, let's just add a comment, because it may not be instantly, uh, um, instantly um, uh, understandable what is, the, what is the idea here, but we can say uh, create, uh, just spell this right, create, uh, create uh, both uh, windows and uh, make uh, them visible, but uh, this time I'm not going to make history uh, visible because uh, I'd like to make visible only the main window, right? It's, it's reasonable. I don't have any history. Why should I open the second window right away? Give them the main screen, right? And make uh, main view visible. Okay, so how do I control this? Um, uh, it's really, I just, I want to keep the code inside my controller to a minimum, an absolute minimum. Uh, so what I'd like to do is, um, I'd like to create uh, the main and, and history. I'd like to create those two windows. Uh, and um, um, and uh, in the view history here, a view history, the source code, scroll down, find the main method implementation, and instead of making it visible unconditionally, don't do it, right? Just, uh, just uh, create, a, uh, create an object. Uh, now, of course, um, uh, so right now, the way the uh, both history and um, uh, bo both uh, history and uh, uh, main view is uh, are created is not very um, very useful for me because I would like to get access to my uh, windows. Uh, so um, uh, you know what? Uh, um, typically, um, uh, typically, what you would like to do maybe is that. Um, let me see. So we create the two of these windows, and uh, uh, what we need to do at this point, uh, we need to have our controller. We need to have our controller uh, uh, access both of these windows. So what I'm thinking now is that instead of uh, doing it right here. Um, I will move this code to uh, to the uh, uh, view main, um, and um, I could um, I could reuse some of this code. So let me make the, the, the a few changes here. Um, uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh. 